Hi guys, uh, welcome back. So um, we did January's with a normal kit and you can see all the little bits coming through. So we're gonna try again, but we're not going to use a kit. So I'm hoping this is coming out clear because it's really hard to tell how focused the um, page is on my itty bitty little screen. I am focusing here, so hopefully it is focusing. I tried focusing on this one, but it didn't want to at all. Okay, so I have a little bag full of options. So we did do the, the Koi recently, but that's more bluish. Let's see if we can try to do something that's a little more color appropriate. We have some bees. This is some succulents. We have a little unicorn one that's kind of um, rainbowy. We have some little blue toaster baby. We've got some blue boba. We have a back to school one, a little apple one, more of the little plants. We have, oops. We've got duckies and berries. We've got some rainbow colored happy bugs. We have the koala one that I opened recently. We have some more little duckies. We have some more little drinks. This one is um, more of the boba one. That one actually might work. It's blue, but it might go, go well. So maybe that one. And then we've got some crayons that go with the back to school ones. We have some more koalas and some sunflowers, some of the little lavender bees, and then some coffee, which could go with pretty much anything, but I'm gonna put it here with the boba. I thought I had more, but it, it's all I have in my little pouch right now. So just give me one second. I'm gonna go look one more place to see if I have any more. Okay, so um, I found this that I specifically bought for February. So we're gonna try to use this one with the rest. This is the whole kit. And then um, we looked through all the washi tapes and couldn't find much. And my son's upstairs grabbing more washi tape right now because apparently there's another little group of it up there that um, didn't get grabbed. My daughter told me that she found it, but she didn't bring it down with her. Um, so he's going up and grabbing that right now. This is from Wonton A Million. I have never used their stickers before, just their like deco stuff. If I can get this off, I would be thrilled. Okay, here we go. I don't know if this is gonna be any better, but we're gonna give it a try. I have a feeling it's not going to be being any better though. Yeah, not really much better. I still think it's cute, but it's not great. So let's do this side also. Uh, we'll try to do the straight washi coming up, but I did buy this one specifically for February and since I don't have anything else planned. Kinda looks like crap. Okay, well, we're trying new things here. So we have the little month, and we're gonna put the month right here over the top of Hello Kitty's face. <laughs> um, and then we have these little things that we can like cover up the days with and then add our own days. I don't know if that is worth it. We can give it a try though. This, okay, so we have that. And then I think we're starting on Sunday. So we'll put Saturday here. Like I said, I'm not sure how well this is gonna work, but we're just gonna do our best. And honestly, if we have a couple of duds in here while we try to figure stuff out, it's not that big of a deal. I mean, it does suck a little bit when they don't work but whatever. So let's lay this one down now. Let's 
they were yelling back and forth at each other a minute ago, so I must have given him the wrong directions. Whoops. My bad. Alright. There we go. Alright, that's kind of cute. Minus the fact that you can see right through it. But overall, that's kind of cute. And then we have a lot of these little things, but not a ton. Okay, so I went and I retrieved my um, other washies. And so we got some bow ties in different colors, as well as one that's got hearts on it. Um, I like the hearts, so I think we're gonna use that one. And then I think I'm gonna go with the light pink one and then one of the dark pink ones. Let's go with the darkest pink. The rest of them are all kind of like in the middle. And so I'm gonna put them back in my little bag. Whenever I get something from uh, Scribble Prints, like one of the grab bags, they always send a ton of stuff, a ton of washies. And I've never really used any of them. So I figure this is like a good time to try them out. So here we go. We're going to use some washi tape on my thing. I don't have like a little washi cutter, but I do have like a Costco card. <laughs> So I'm gonna use my Costco card because I don't have another better option. Normally I would use like a credit card, but it's probably not safe to put my credit card information on the internet, even for you guys, because someone weird might watch. Okay, okay, so let's see here. Um, let's do this first one and we'll do like a gradual. So we'll start with the dark pink. And we're going to just lay it on here. And then we're going to Costco card it. And tear. It's not too bad, right? And then we're going to... Jenny's crying again. She does this a lot. She's very needy. If you have any needy little girls, maybe you'll understand. And layer it on top of each other maybe like that I'm not so good at the washi game I I can watch these girls do their washi stuff and be like entranced to be like oh my god how do you do that I can't do it I don't know I am not one of those girls so we're just gonna make this what we can do do our best and see how it looks at the end. There we go. Okay, I mean, that's not too bad, right? I don't know how they do it. They make it look all pretty and like do all the clippies in the end and make it look all fancy. All right, so this side, we're gonna do a little bit down here. Let's do the opposite this time. And just stick it on this way. I don't know if I should do anything for the sidebar or not. Normally I wouldn't, but I don't know if I should. That is upside down. Yeah, I'll figure this washy stuff out, I swear. I don't know if it's gonna be now or never, but yeah. And hope. Okay. There we go. All right. Um, and then I have my washies. We'll put them aside. And then we have um, our little things. Hopefully my pen will work on it. They are a little bit, I don't have anything to like test it on though. All right, so first we're going to do um, books that I finished and then we can kind of move on from there and we'll kind of figure this out as we go because I'm not positive how to do this. So I finished CC3. 
and I finished Plain Jane. Um, it was okay. It was really cute. And then I finished Loser 1. Oh my god. Yeah, because I am very, very talented at this. Um, we did Mislaid Parts. Uh, half known. Also a good book. And then we finished Poison Heart. I am looking forward to reading her new book. Um, it just came out as like something about death. So it's like a Snow White retelling. Um, then we finished. I don't know how I'm going to do the month where I did 20, which was last month. This month I'm doing decent, but not that good. It also doesn't help I lost my headphones. And so running around trying to listen to books without my headphones is not nice to the rest of the people in my house. So mm, Legend Born, that was a really good uh, series. And there is like one more that's coming out soon. Okay. I think that's everything. That is entirely too convenient. All right, so on the 5th, we had two books got, that got finished. Hopefully these will fit well. Oh, they do, they fit nicely. They are a little on the big side. So that could potentially be a problem. And then I finished Loser here. Uh, Loser was fun. I still have not read the other half of it yet. So basically she wrote like a 1200 page book and then split it in half. Mm -hmm. And then Miss Lee Parts is on the 8th. And then Poison Heart is on the 9th. I don't have any bills to put in. I don't put my bills in here. Um, and then we'll flip back on the 13th is Wicked Fate right over the start of Mardi Gras. I'd like to go to Mardi Gras someday. I really, really enjoy um, being in New Orleans, but I've never been there for Mardi Gras. And of course that time of the year is a very busy, first of all, but it's also really nice because it's not like overly hot. Okay, okay. So now what I have left is these little ones. Um, I think I'm gonna put work stuff here. So we have, let's see, let's do my schedule first and see if I can put them all in. So we have flex and I'm just gonna put in, um, Shoot, let's do the times. I guess we don't need to have the um, amount in this one. And then Pat did it, and then I did it again. So this is when I was actually starting to get into doing it again. Unfortunately, it's that weird time of the year where they hire a bunch of people to um, to do it, they hire a bunch of new people because it is right during, of course it's gonna go right here. They hire a bunch of people to do flex for Prime Day. And then we end up with too many flex workers and don't have any shifts. And so we're just starting to get the shifts back again. We'll start to get them back a lot once school starts. And it's very, very frustrating because last thing you want to do is lose your source of income because there's nothing available. It's like we get base, but base is $25 an hour, which sounds like so much money until you take into consideration that you also have to uh, use your car. So you have to have extra maintenance on your car you have to buy your own gas. You have to pay your own taxes. 
and all of a sudden it's not nearly as much money and so we all of us that I know of all the like veteran drivers try not to take minimums because minimums end up costing us more money and that really sucks and I hate it and of course because of Prime they hire a bunch of new people they always think that they're going to need them and then lo and behold they don't need them it ends up being a total crapshoot because what do you do when all of a sudden you don't have any shifts left for all your workers because you hired too many because you thought Prime Day was going to be busy and it wasn't. No part of me gets it. I don't shop on Amazon very often. I do if I have to. But if I can avoid going to Amazon, I will 100% avoid going to Amazon. All right, I only have a couple of workouts in here because of, I don't know, laziness. I got out of the habit. I don't know, something. So I'm going to put both workouts in since there's literally two of them. I've been working out recently and I'm hoping that I can keep it up, but <laughs> we'll see. Okay. All right, so there's my workouts. Um, and then we have paydays. We have two of those, so I'll go ahead and put those in. These are my husband's paydays, not mine, because um, my paydays are pretty much every day. I get paid Monday through Thursday, Monday through Friday. Um, and then so Friday, Saturday, Sunday, you get paid on Monday. And then um, every other day of the week, you get paid the next day. So you get paid for Monday on Tuesday, that type of thing. All right, I did have COVID in here, so I did mark that off. So hello, beautiful. Hi, baby. It's a good girl. All right, so we'll do this one. If I can get it up to mark off that I had COVID for four days. Four bad days. Um, we didn't realize what it was because my son had just gotten his teeth pulled and um, he was sick because of it and we didn't realize that it was more than just his teeth being pulled. We thought the stress of his teeth caused him to get sick. There's a cat on, on top of me right now so if I sound weird or hey or you can see something fuzzy that's what it is. I'm trying to keep her from completely getting in the way, but she can see her because she is very, very needy. Um, let's see, we also have birthdays and we do have one birthday. My beautiful girl needs to get her butt out of my face. Okay, we do have one birthday. On the 9th. And this is my husband's birthday. And we have little hearts. I can add a little heart on. Yay, look, little heart. He <laughs> he. Okay, don't mind me. Um, and then we also have like duty stuff. And I don't know how to put that in. Do I put it in like on the little strips? Do I put it in on like washi? Do I grab a sticker? Well, how do I put this in? Let's look at it so far. Okay, so it's not looking bad, I don't think. So the last thing I have in here is I have our anniversary, which I have an important, but I don't have an anniversary. And then I have like little things, like I have duty days and that kind of stuff. Give me a second, I'll be back. Okay, so I have these left over from um, a kit that I bought. So I pulled them out and I have these two colors. I'm gonna go with this one. Um, is it a perfect match? No, will it work? God, I hope so. All right. So we are going to put in 
couple more things. I think I have three duty days on here. I don't know why I only have three. Let's look. I haven't been probably putting them in. I was out with COVID. Okay, I'm not positive why I only have a handful of duty days in here. But I'm probably just going to put them in. So let's put in... Um, the first one's on the first. So let's put this down with one of my little girls. And then we're going to put in duty because it's a duty day. And then he also had one on Saturday. So we will pick it up just a little bit. I need to buy something else for these because um, I don't have any more after this. And then that's not gonna fit. Okay, so he would have had it here and then he would have had it here and here. So we'll just put them in those spots. And then I'll find a way to muscle one into his birthday area. If you can hear the sink, I apologize, but I'm not going to stop my kid from doing the dishes. It doesn't happen often. Okay, so we have duty days in. And then he would have missed this one because I was sick. And if I was sick, then he wasn't going to be allowed to go in either. Elise? Okay. And then we'll just write in here. Like that. Um, and then... Alright, and then the last one I have is right here. And I'm going to probably put a full box in because that just seems... A good idea. And then let's put in some hearts. This was 23 years. Like that yet. And then we will basically put it in here and cover up most of the day. Like that. All right, the only thing I have left in here is Pat's shifts, but I don't think I need to put those in. I think my shifts are plenty, and then his duty days. Oh, I think that looks cute. Okay, so cool, cool, cool. Hopefully it is focusing. And I'm gonna go ahead and stop this really quick, put the date dots in, and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we go, and I'm going to try something. We will see if this works. I don't know if it will, but we're going to try it anyways. So I'm going to make a long Okay. So we're going to cut this here. And then I'm going to take the end. And we're going to cut it like that to make it look a little bit schmancier. Isn't she or schmancier? Jin Jin, honey. And then for this one, we're going to turn it inside out. and make it cutesy. Put it like this. And cut it here. And then the last one, we're going to also do the little cut on the bias. And then we will open it up. 
and then we'll make it even shorter. Okay, so that is what I'm trying to do with this. I probably should have cut this beforehand so that it matched the other ones, but we're just gonna say that it looks fine. So there we go. I think this will be a decent start. I It's not perfect, but I think it looks pretty cute still. And so we'll go from there. All right, so that's it. Lots of washi left, obviously. A couple of dates left. I have this that I can use for later. I also have this that I can use for later. Um, little military girls. And then I have the bell part of it left. And that's it. I hope you would like it. Hopefully this turned out all right. And I will see you guys again soon.